All right, our forced movie reviews. Each of us were forced a movie to watch by someone on the show. The rule was to make it basically your second favorite movie ever. And so Morgan number two reviewed Still Magnolias, and she gave it 4.5 out of five Shelbys. Because I'm assuming Shelby is a main character on the movie, right, guys? Yes. Yeah? Yes. Okay. Lunchbox watched Black Panther and gave it 2.5 out of 5 Wakandas because Wakanda is where they live in Black Panther. I was surprised that his rating was so low, but he gave it 2.5 out of 5 Wakandas. Correct. Now, yeah. Uh, Amy watched Parasite yesterday. We're now going to get her review. Ooh. And Eddie is uh, the person who told you to watch this movie. Correct. And he did it a little bit to be funny because... Yeah. He did you it to just be watched awful. another foreign language film, and he said, "Let's do." But to be fair, when Eddie was talking about Parasite, he said it was one of his favorite movies of all time, weeks and weeks ago. Correct. Okay, but what I need to know about favorite movies of all time is a lot of us watch them multiple times. There's no way Eddie's watching Parasite again. I don't think the rule has to be you watch it multiple times. I think. Oh, really? So I've seen some movies like Hitch probably twenty times. I wouldn't say it's right. one of my fifteen top favorite movies. I really like it. Okay, what's your favorite movie of all time? Uh, Man on the Moon, Andy Kaufman's How story with How many times have you seen it? Probably three. Okay. There's I don't a, need okay. to see it a lot. I got the experience okay, fine. from my heart. Fine, Parasite is a one and done. Okay, you watch Parasite. Go ahead, talk yeah. to me here. <laughs> so, it was really good. <laughs> so, uh, it, it, wow. Uh, it took yeah. me... Yeah. Okay, wow. yeah. It took me a minute to get in the subtitle groove. I watched it on Hulu, which is amazing. If you have Hulu, you can watch it on there for free. But they have English and Spanish subtitles at the same time. Huh? So that got a little distracting. And I took Spanish for eight years. So sometimes I would go down to the Spanish section and see if I could figure it out. <laughs> but I, I stuck mostly with the English and I thought it was good. I definitely... It, I had no idea what it was about. I had no idea what to expect. So it, it, I, it went a couple of directions. I had no idea. I gasped out loud a few times. I give it four out of five parasites. Wow, that's good. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, but I'm, saying... I'm not going to watch it again. Okay, but you don't have to. No one's forcing you to watch it again, <laughs> like ever. Okay, we get it. But are you saying you're surprised at how good it was? Yes. Very. Are you saying you're surprised at how good it was even though you had to read subtitles the whole time? Very. Yeah. Me too. I was the same way. And I thought it was really good too. But okay, there you Wait, go. How, what did you give it, it when you rated it? Do you remember? About the same because yeah. I thought it was a little overhyped to me, but I can still take something overhyped and enjoy it and know it's good. Uh, Caitlin and I watched it and we were both like, we don't want to sit through two hours of listening to Korean and having to read the bottom of the screen. But about 20 minutes into it, you just start to feel Korean. I did anyway. <laughs> you pretty much yeah. learn Korean when you yeah, watch it. I'm, I'm basically. in. Yeah, I was. I felt like I was doing Rosetta Stone, South Korea. So it was <laughs> okay. But Amy, you liked Parasite. Would you recommend it to our listeners? Yes, I recommend it. Yeah, okay. <laughs> it's amazing. I know. Nice job. All right, we're reviewing these movies. They were forced movie reviews, and Lunchbox drew my name, and he forced me to watch a movie called Box of Moonlight, which was weird. Because we all said, we'll pick our second favorite movie for someone. And I'd never heard of this movie. I think he was doing it as punishment. Uh, it was the lowest rated on Rotten Tomatoes. It came out in 1996. There was just a lot of weird things happening here with this movie. Uh, it's called, Again, Box of Moonlight. Before we get into this, has anyone else ever heard of Box of Moonlight? No. no. Okay. We're all on Amy. Never. Ever heard of Box of Okay. Movie Mike, you, you specialize in movies. You do yeah. a podcast on it. I've seen a lot of movies. I've never heard of this movie. You've never even heard of it? No. Okay. So I brought Caitlin up into the room. Um, my girlfriend, Caitlin, watched it with me last night. Caitlin, thank you for being a part of this review. You're welcome. Because I just want honesty to come out. Yeah, absolutely. And so we, we laid down to watch it, and I said, will you watch this movie? And, and you thought it was called, because uh, we kept searching for Box of <laughs> Moonlight. <laughs> And she was like, are you sure it's not Fox in the Moonlight? Yeah, we, we were getting mixed up. We were like, sun in the light. We, it was it would, bad. The, the it screen wouldn't find bad. it. Yeah, we... we, we. So, uh, again, I, Lunchbox, what about this movie was so good to you before <laughs> I give you the review? Well, it was just... It, it was a... I, I was 17 at the time when I went to see it, and it really made me think, man, slow down and enjoy life. Like... A lot of people take life so serious and you get in such a hurry and you get wrapped up in everything and you stress about out about things and you don't take time to have fun. 
And this, when this guy goes and he finds this other guy and he's like, hey, dude, let loose. You are so tied up in your business. Like, relax and enjoy life. It's going to pass you by before you know it. So it really, to me, was a life lesson to just enjoy life and relax a little bit. And I felt like it related to your life a lot because you work all the time and you don't ever relax. Well, it was $9.99, which stunk. Dang. I had to buy it on demand at $9.99. Not $2.99 or $3.99 on (laughs) iTunes. It was $9.99. And so we hit it, and it was an hour and 51 minutes long, which we both looked at and we're like, oh, boy. Yeah. Yeah. Um, But we, we watched it. It's called Box of Moonlight. And what what'd you think about it? Just not good. It was terrible, guys. It <laughs> was so bad. It was garbage. Uh-huh. If anyone out there is thinking about, you know, I got a little time on my hands. I might watch a, the movie called Box of... Stay away from Box of Moonlight. Watch every box instead of Box of Moonlight. Right. It's Haters. so simple that it's confusing. It's And it's shot <laughs> odd. And I just didn't want to come up and say this as my own opinion. But Rotten Tomatoes is right. It's a 61%. That's a D. That's almost an F. Honestly, that's generous. Yeah. So. I have a question. Go ahead. I just, I honestly, I mean, I get why he said he liked it, but it's just so weird. And there's a lot of male nudity. Oh, yeah. It shows Wieners Which a lot. I didn't what? appreciate. Maybe that's yeah, why Lux Walks like it. Four times. That's why I'm wondering why it's his favorite movie. It's a lot of male what? genitalia. Yeah. It is. Hold on. Wait. Maybe he no doesn't teeth? even know why he loved it so much. Oh, that's right. Lunchbox no is. No teeth. <gasps> took Lunchbox as a kid to go see this? It's all making sense no, no, no. now. I was 16, 17 years old. I was in high that, school because I drove to the movie theater after high school and met No Teeth Keith there, and it was my first independent film. Kid. And it was yeah, such it, a good movie. There's definitely Ooh. four ding-dongs that are seen straight <laughs> up. Yeah. Wow. And I'm talking not even just a hint, like run by the screen, but pause. Yeah. It started to be a joke with us. It, it was the movie was not good. It it wasn't even like a movie you look at and go, well, that kind of even though it didn't hold up so well with time, it was still it was just it was garbage. What was so, it wasn't rated? <laughs> what hey Mike, what's that movie Is rated? It X. <laughs> no, it was rated R. It was, it was rated, rated R. R. Wow. Oh, wow. What is it, Mike? Yeah, rated R. Yeah. What's the? Is there like a five ding dong limit that it goes to seventeen or? <laughs> right. Wow, uh, wow, that's I can't crazy. believe you guys didn't accept it into your life and understand it. Maybe you guys it was just too smart for you. I, I give can't... it I give it one half moon of out of five. <laughs> one half moon. Not even a full moon. What do you give out of the out of five moons? Uh, I can you go less than that? You can go whatever you want. I'll go half. half I'll a... go half as well. Okay. Yeah. Wow. We're going half of one moon. Point five <laughs> moons out of five. I'm just so confused. Yeah. I thought to, I thought it was a joke. She thought I was making her watch a joke film or something so bad that it was like to watch her reaction. Like, she's like, is this for TikTok? Are you doing something to judge my reaction? Just a bit. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, so man, there I you have bad. it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's I, nothing I, personal. No, I, listen, I don't take it personal. It's just something that I think Bobby could accept in his life of relaxing because you would agree he works all the time. He needs to relax a little bit. And I thought Lunchbox, this movie. The guy cheats on his wife. Hey, that's not, how not, he relaxes. Not, not me. Not Bobby. The guy in the movie. <laughs> the guy in the movie. His way of relaxing is like getting naked with other guys and cheating on his wife. Yeah, it's the whole thing, guys. There, so yes, Amy. There's a part where the, he, he, yeah, him and this dude get naked and then he, yeah, it's a whole thing. Quite frankly, I hope that's not how Bobby decides to relax. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> So that's the only reason she didn't like it. She doesn't like the no, cheating no. aspect. It was a ter- it was a terrible oh, movie no. way before that. Yeah, yeah. Way. Okay. Uh. Point five <laughs> moons out of five is what we give it. I kind of want to see this movie now just to watch what you guys are talking about. <laughs> no. It's so good. Eddie, okay. admit it. You want to see the ding dongs? No. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>